I think it's the ability to have the free feeling, being on the water, away from everything that you're connected with except for the ocean. And for me, it's the, the chance also to, to be alone. I've been involved with the sport for quite a long time, and I suppose that now is my passion is to find new, extraordinary places which are wild, maybe cold, not sunny and hot, you know. The kite surfing that I would do it would be to find a spot and go and explore the best waves and have, have the best fun in, in, in that environment. For me, kite surfing is, is all about the journey, so in fact the journey starts from the planning and the, the packing. The kite surfing is generally fantastic, but it's actually the journey that makes it really, really special. Some of the conditions in the United Kingdom are really special for kite surfing, and many of them require extra special journeys to get to. And um, these, are, these kite surfing times that you put the extra effort into are often the most memorable. That adventure is what makes that session. So to go on the longest journey, whatever that may be, could be the most special time that you could have in blowing wind and huge amounts of rain, freezing cold temperatures. People might say you're crazy, but actually that could be the most memorable time that you could have.